Hello everyone, welcome back to another Baku No Roblox Remastered video. Today I'm going to be giving you the recent update codes that are available for a quite a while. I think they're available for like another week or two. So yeah, we have three codes to give you today for this game which give you money and level helps and all those types of things and the music is down very, very low just because of um, copyright reasons. But I did actually upload yesterday on Treasure Hunt Simulator Roblox and YouTube hated me yesterday so they were broken so if you guys want to go see that video make sure to go check my channel out now for toy code not toy codes medieval world cards over there so let's just get straight into it today okay we're starting off in front of the All Might statue because why not <laughs> I'm finally level 102 on this game. It took me quite a while to level up, but uh, we are back in the game. But we're going to start with the change log as per usual. So the change log for today, which is recently updated, is it uploaded two days ago actually. So we got some, we got new stuff here today. So the update log added fling protection for your characters. DK. Decay and NPC fixes are now fixed because there is a new Decay quirk in the game and they added mobile and tablet support as well as there is a new naval laser quirk and they updated the map to winter theme with bug fixes. So the current quirks that we do have are engine, voice, gigant gigantification, hardening, jet regeneration, zero gravity, summon, summon, summon ballist? naval laser and then your uncommon quirks are air propulsion electric shock absorption warp gate health flame black hole permation prim permation and pop off the rare quirks are dark shatter cremation quirkless muscle augmentation decay which is the newest one and then of course the legendary quirks are one for all half cold half hot explosion and overhaul so if you didn't watch my last Baku no Roblox game, um, we kind of showed you how to get unlimited XP and we're going to show you that again today because that video was months ago now. So we're just going to, we're just going to head over to the gym currently. I, it's a, actually no, we're going to head over to UA first because that's where we all want to start our hero journey over at UA because that's where we all want to get accepted into hero school, of course. And you can actually glitch out the sprint. Um, so you can glitch it out, like, kind of. Like, see, there we go. I glitched it out. You just gotta, like, push sprint a bit. But you can actually sprint while it's going up. But how awesome is that? It's, like, the best glitch in this game. So let's see. We have Deku over here, and if you don't know what Deku, Deku does, he actually has a quest for you. So if you click him, he says, Hey there, I'm Midoriya. Are you here to inherit my abilities? You will need Quirkless plus level 1500 to be able to inherit it. Sorry, but I do not meet the requirements. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know I don't meet the requirements, unfortunately. So yeah, <laughs> it's actually impossible to get Quirkless level 1500 without a quirk from the beginning. I currently have air cannon, and if you don't know what that is, it's... Oh gosh. I need to... There we go. Basically air. I am an airbender, okay? <laughs> so yeah, um, you actually need to get a quirk, level up that quirk, and level up your mobility and stuff, and then you have to re-roll for the quirk. I think it's like 5,000 per re-roll. I'm not entirely 100% sure. But yeah, that is UA and that's Deku's quest. But we're going to go find the gym to go get some XP. Because you can actually buy stuff from the shop. I've already done this, but my stats though. Let me just put the rest into strength because that's what I want to put it into. And in my inventory, I have a katana and a cape. So I can look like Dark Shatter in the darkness. I'm weird, okay? Don't, don't worry with me. And I'm completely in the wrong direction. Oh, he has the gigantification quirk. Oh my goodness, he's so tall. It's a very different type of quirk system in here compared to Heroes Online. Over at that red building over here, which is in front of me, that is the shop where you can go and purchase like your guns from, your 
swords from, all types of gear like that. You can buy Bakugo's um, gauntlet type things for his wrists. I don't exactly know what they're called, don't kill me. I'm still a noob at My Hero Academia. Ah. But actually, My Hero Academia update. I actually got to interview All Might at the Melbourne Anime Convention and it was amazing. He is such a nice person in real life and it was amazing to meet him and we got to see the heroes, well, two heroes movie like a month in advance before it even came out in cinemas. So that was amazing. I've seen that like three times already <laughs> and still not on DVD yet, which sucks. So this green building here is the gym. So this, this is my favorite building because it's actually a safe zone. So if you go in here, it's a safe zone. You can't be killed. You have a force field and all you have to do basically is just hit. Like I'm getting like what a few, like a few hundred XP every single time I'm hitting it. I don't think I have the double XP game pass. I don't think I bought any on here, but you can get XP very, very fast. Like you can just AFK here while clicking or you can just be sitting here watching a YouTube video on the side and you can just be clicking it. I still need to level up though because I cannot even find the fight, the weak villains in this. I So I've just been grinding away here at the gym. So this is basically unlimited experience and I love it because it's like such an easy way to get it. And something that I would never have thought to have done if I didn't get showed it by my friend. As I said, I'm a noob in these types of games. I'm not the best, but you know, what can you do? And from that, I got three, I get three stats. Three points every time I level up, so we can just put it all into strength. We're at 200 strength now, which is amazing. So let's see, who can we go and fight? Hmm. I know we cannot fight any of these because they just one-shot us. So we have to go and find the people near UA. So we have to go back over to UA. Oh my goodness. This is going to take a while. Do you actually, no, can I fight you guys, maybe? We'll see if we can fight these guys. So. Or they could just all die at once. Yeah, I'm so OP. They all just died at once. No, that's not how it works. Let's see. Oh, no. They one shot. Okay, they one shot. Hello, I'm upside down. Just me normally. <laughs> oh, gosh. Hey, but that's so good because we spawned near UA, which is what we needed to be at anyway. So, psh. For those people that say that I'm bad at this game, I know when I need to die or not. These guys I can take care of in like three hits. One, two, <gasps> see, I, I can do it if I run, but I still hit him. I killed him, but he also killed me. So it's like a, it's a win-win situation if you want to do that like 15 times for a current quest. But yes, we'll get on to the cards for today because I have three cards for you and they do work and I have already claimed them so I cannot redeem them again, unfortunately. So let's see. Ah, so menu, option, cards. So the first card for today, and I do not know if these are caps lock sensitive or not. Please do not judge me if they are not. So the first card is 10k likes. And I'm sorry if you hear the fan. It is very, very, very hot in here. So let me just turn that up really quickly. Huh, there we go. So the second card for today is for their 1 million people update and that's 1 mil. As I said, do not know if these are case sensitive or not. Just type them how exactly how I'm typing them and they should work. And the final card for today is T0MUR4. And that one I haven't claimed, which gives us 50,000 cash. So if you want to do spins, that is the best thing that you could possibly do. So yeah, basically that's all of the cards and I'm not sure if they have any more. I will quickly check if they have done any more because they release one every single time they hit 10,000 new likes. So there is one for 11,000 likes that should be here in the update log. And then they're also going to be releasing one for 12,000 likes. I'm not really sure when we're going to hit that. Okay, so the Tomer card was for the 11k likes. It gets a bit confusing when they release so many different cards and you don't know what they're for. But you can always just check their Discord or check their homepage because that's where they put them all. So, yeah. Let's just go quickly talk to... I... That, 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 that. Let's just go talk to... Let's just talk to him. Shh. 
Defeating 15 weak villains? Aw, oh, man. I can't even defeat one, let alone 15. It looks like we're going to have to level up in this game a lot more to be able to beat this game. And hopefully we can get Deku's power by the next time we do this video. Because I would love to do that. And I missed out my chance on killing him there. Rip me. But it's all good. I hope you guys enjoyed today's little mini Baku no Roblox video. If you guys want to know or want me to play this in future, please let me know. I would love to play this a lot more. I've just been holding it off just because it is a very grindy game. I love grindy games, but at the same time, they're also very time consuming and I don't always have the time to do this type of stuff. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. Make sure to tune in to my Twitch stream because I am streaming at 7, 6 p.m. or 7 p.m. American Eastern Standard Time over on my Twitch channel. It is down in the description below for you guys to go over there and check out. So yeah, I hope to see you guys over there. Make sure to have a lovely day on next video and I'll see you guys in the next video or a stream. Bye guys!